Hi there, my name is Nicola. Welcome to my channel. After long nine episodes of my free HTML and CSS course, I want to do something new. I want to make some Photoshop tutorial and show you how we can design this kind of header. Originally, it is about one Serbian company called Calypso. They provide cell services, car wash in Shabbats. The whole website originally will be on Serbian language, but I translated some text for you. In next tutorial, I will build this design in WordPress. Before we start, check my free HTML and CSS course, subscribe to my channel. If you have any questions, write down in the comments. Let's go. Okay, I'm using the Photoshop CC here. And this is the original sketch. I will uh, leave it open. So from time to time, I will switch it to uh, see my progress. Okay. First, let's create the new file. And our width, our width will be 1600 by 600. The resolution will be seven, uh, 72 pixels. And you see the, the settings here. Let's click on create. Here. Uh, now, uh, first, let's add the background for our page, for our header actually. Uh, the background will be this color here uh, E9, E9, E9. And let's make this. Let's color it. Okay. And then let's add our first rectangle tool, press here and type the width, the width here, and later we will adjust the height. Okay, uh, change the color, I, I want to be the pure white, for example, for now, and then click here to select the move tool. Click Ctrl A to select everything and choose this uh, button here, align horizontal centers. Okay, they select all with Ctrl D and move our, our rectangle on the top. Set the, uh, here set the rulers. If you don't see it just like me, press Ctrl R to unhide it. Okay. And uh, I want uh, first I want to add this this kind of white uh, rectangle with some uh, white shadow with some shadow here. Okay, let's click on Control T, adjust our height, and here in the bottom click on right click and choose blending options. There, set the drop shadow. This is my settings. By the way, this is the default settings. Uh, pause this video and set it just like me or choose your own. Okay, see here we have our shadow. For undo in one step, click Ctrl Z. Okay, now let's uh, first let's rename our layers. I want to be organized. And this is the main background. Sorry. Okay. And this is the white no. uh, shadow. Shadow background. Okay, now let's change first. Let's uh, set the top bar and make one ruler here. And height for our top bar will be 40 pixels. When you move your ruler, press Shift and you will move in increments by 10 pixels. Sorry. This, and this like, and this here. Okay. Let's see what we have here. We have our text in top bar and social icons. First, 
and let's set let's make another group and type top bar and here let's set the text just like this and type oh, let me first let me change the color I'm going to use I don't know maybe this kind of color here let me see my notes oh I don't have for example let me see here which color Ah, uh, 30, 30, 30, this color. Okay, select all and type here three times 30. Okay, then type the second word and set our working times. Okay, uh, one more time, I want to say that this is not the pixel perfect approach so you can select this font and I'm using the Montserrat here you can find it on uh, Google fonts library download and install to your computer to your machine change the types of font and here you can set the values originally I think this is the for purpose of this sketch will be size of 40 pixels but later in next tutorial our values will be different when we when we build the wordpress edition so called yeah okay oh, this is too much for example let's say 28 okay let's add uh, here we need the social icons so let me edit from another tutorial. It is Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. Okay, this is here, but let's set it in um, one folder in one group. Social icons. Sorry for that background noise. I have a very loud baby in my neighborhood. And now the first icon will be Facebook, then Instagram, then YouTube. So let's set it here, YouTube and Facebook here. Okay, let's move, select the whole group, click on uh, we with is shortcut for this move tool and move our icons in top right corner here. Uh, one more thing, I want to move this uh, rulers from here or to add another one. I want to set 40 pixels from this edge inside. Uh, now this is the 1430, press shift and I want to be 1390 see and this is the increments by 10 okay and same thing is here okay and then move this working hours here and this social icons oh, i want working hours outside of this group and move it here just like here then click on Control T. The same settings is you can find here on Edit, and this is the transform, uh, free transform actually options. Control T or Command T if you using the Mac. If you are using Mac, if you want to see, if you want to have more symmetry, hold down Shift and Alt key and change the size of these icons just like me okay now <coughs> sorry and now let's make some space between those icons currently it is eight pixels one two three four now we have 12 i think 
one, two, three, four. When you use the uh, when you are using arrows, the increments is one pixel, and when you click on when you hold the shift and move with arrows, the increments is I think yeah, there is ten pixels. Okay. This is our social icons and working hours here. And also, let's me copy this uh, hand cursor because I want to simulate the hover state for our link and move it here on the top of these icons because if you set beneath, our icon will be behind the YouTube icon. Okay, now let's change, let's save our sketch so far. Let's choose your own name here. Okay, and now what we have next, we have this uh, header part with logo and some text here. Okay, let's close this top bar section add another group with name of header and click here click on a rectangle tool let's click here 1260 by 200 okay and let me change the color and the color will be let me see yep this one 30 30 just like color for our working hours here to change uh, color for this rectangle tool click here on properties if you don't see it click on window and check I think properties yeah here and choose our 30 30 30 color now let's center it by this outside rulers not this inside okay and now let's add our logo the calypso oh, sorry let's choose the logo and choose this text here this is the center and let's move the for example 12 or 12 20 pixels up press sh uh, hold shift and type two times up arrow i think one uh, 10 pixels from the center will be much better okay here we can we have clips of logo and this text here also this is the oh this is not this is ubuntu let's change it i want to be montserrat but of course you can use the Ubuntu or any other font that you want. This is the Montserrat extra light and this is the 24 pixel side. Okay, this is the self-service car wash. Let's add some space between logo and this text. Okay, let's save our work again and we have to build this menu bar here. Before that, let's add some, in my original sketch, original idea is that here on this space will be, I, uh, I think, a video, yeah, drone footage from sky, from air. But for purpose of this tutorial and sketch, I'm already set this rectangle with this shade of gray. And this shade is 777F. Okay, let's create here one. Okay, click on rectangle. This is our settings. Oh, I think this is too much. No. Yeah, but this is white color. We need this one. Click on properties and choose the last one here. Okay, now let's center our video. Let's type here video back, video background, and align it inside this outer 
rulers and here I need the 40 pixels of space. Let me see. We have 22 now. Okay, now it's zero, but track this 22 pixels for now. Press shift and move to the 40. Oh, now it is 43. Let's press three times up arrow. One, two, three, and check. I think we have and here I think that we have 40 pixels. A little less, but never mind. Let's move it again. Let's say that we have that here we have 40 pixels. Okay. And also I want to a little bit speed up. I will copy this menu here. Let's copy the whole this whole group of with menu actually and this the loop this search icon here okay now we need we can move this inner rulers and also here i'm using montserrat with regular for uh, weight i think 22 pixels and color is FF0606. Okay, and the space between, if you want to make the space between your 